Last week, the governor ordered restaurants to close dining rooms and only offer takeout or delivery. Although many restaurants have been able to stay open so far, a lot of a lot of employees have been laid off or had their hours cut significantly. Now, local volunteers are offering hope to those people. LEX 18's Claire Kopsky has that story. Starting tonight at 5 p.m., Great Bagel and Bakery in Lexington is keeping their kitchen open a few extra hours. In a partnership with other local restaurants, they're inviting former restaurant workers who have lost their jobs or have reduced hours due to the coronavirus to their drive-by table. They have a couple of chefs who are back in the kitchen and they are social distancing themselves and pre prepping the food and preparing stuff that's been donated and or stuff that they've been able to purchase with that grant money so that they have food. When patrons pull up, the questions are simple. The restaurant worker just needs to show some proof of ID and or uh, maybe a pay stub just so that we know that they have been part of the restaurant industry. But a meal is not the only item on the plate. It may be diapers that they might need for their children or you know a couple of canned goods. They're prepared to serve hundreds tonight as they know the need is great. I think it was two days ago they actually came by early and, and we're already looking for food. As long as the food and monetary donations keep coming, dinner will be served for days to come. I hope they actually have a sense of community when they show up and they see that we are, you know, restaurant people helping restaurant people. You know, that's as simple as it is. Lexingtonians getting out there and, and serving each other. Mm -hmm. That would be the great hope. No shame. It's an opportunity to feed those who so often feed us. In Lexington, Claire Kopsky, LEX 18 News.